Hey there guys, my name is Marquez and in this video I will teach you step by step how you can easily add a form and how you can manage form in Asana. So the first thing you want to do is to get to the form is go to top right and you're going to find customize and right here you're going to find form, click on it and here you're going to have forms and what you want to do is simply click add a form. In the moment when you're going to add a form you have option to add questions so I can add a single line text. So we have the name, the email address. Let's say I'm going to add a single line text. Let's say this is going to be profession. Then we can have single select, which, where do you work? So let's say we can add also the question Uh, we can add where do you work and we can simply add the option name so let's say IT and if they are working also in marketing finance and you can always make it required when you would click here so you can connect to field if you want to so in the moment when you're gonna have the fields here uh, you can add a new field and then connect it to right so we have the profession single line text and you're gonna have it available fields task description email address connect to field we can add a field and we can have an email address create a field so you can always connect your like name let's say name can be uh, add a field so name right I can create a field and you will see how then it looks like then I can simply add a date so when did you start working and we can have it required or I can connect to field, add a field, add a date, and then date, date, create a field. And then what I can have attachment, right? File. You can also allow multiple attachments. So in the moment when you have it, what you can do is go to the right settings. And you can have the select a field for task titles from name and you can have let's say name assignee you're going to choose it and then you're going to have the form settings confirmation message then you click done in a moment when you have it I see the project plan here this is it I can preview it and look at this and this is like perfect form that I have now I can also click here and click on a project plan and open it. Loading form and I can go let's say Marek gmail.com profession you choose it. So let's say I'm in uh, CEO marketing where do you work and these are the uh, what we created so let's say marketing when did you start working and let's say we started working in let's say here file and I submit okay your submission has been received go to Sana and now this is how we do, like do it right you see also here project plan submission email address name start date today and that's pretty much it now always if you're going to customize it and you're going to have the form here and you're going to add the project plan I'm going to edit it I need to also like where do you work you need to connect to the field and you need to choose a new field which is going to be the single select so that's pretty much it my recommendation is going different way 
first create let me show you create something that you want so single select let's say status and it's going to be done then it's going to be uh, working on it and then we can have stuck right I'm going to change the colors nice customize two forms edit the form and then you can have the when did you start working or where do you work and connect to field and you can connect it to status and look this will replace the current options for this question with the options from status connect and look at this automatically changed so right now when i'm going to share the form and preview it and also have for people to fill it they will be uh choosing from these so my recommendation create first the columns so that's the first thing that I would do. And when you have that, uh, then continue further for creating the form. And you do this when you're gonna click customize, you're gonna have the form here, the project plan. And here you got it. So thank you very much guys for watching. I hope you're gonna have a great day. If you can have any questions regards how you can use it, what you can do with the form, let me down below in the comments. This is how you can use the forms. And that's pretty much it. Thank you very much. Have a great day and goodbye.